Well, here goes nothing. Oh, this is gonna itch. <laughs> what up, Web? Welcome back to Spider Closet Land. Today, we're gonna talk about why my hands are so darn itchy. This is my hair kicking, making my hands itching. I'm really about to start complaining the pain in the butt, my Broclopelma homori. That's right, my Broclopelma homori. All right, so I'm gonna open this up. This is the newest member of Spider Closet Land. I picked this guy up uh, off of a classified, but he needs a little bit more soil. He likes to burrow. And I want him to have room to burrow. I want him to be happy. I like all of my tarantulas to just be comfortable. Sometimes when they burrow, you don't get to see them. And that totally sucks. But if they're happy, I'm happy. I'm going to see them. I'm going to feed them. I'll know what's going on with them. So my goal right now is I'm going to get this tarantula into this little cup uh, using this straw. With the straw, you could be firm. But at the same time, you're assuring that you're going to be gentle. You do not want to harm your tarantula. Um, the cup that I'm going to get him in, it has a hole in the bottom of it. And the reason for that is when I put this guy into his new home, I can just put this straw right into that. Uh, actually, you know what? I'm going to get the paintbrush. I can just take this paintbrush and put it right into that hole to help push him out into his new home. It makes it a lot easier. Um, sometimes if they're being really stubborn and they're not going with the paintbrush, you can just blow on them a little bit and they'll go. As you can see, this is an absolutely beautiful tarantula. This one has recently molted, so those colors are even more vibrant. But just look at the beauty. This species is considered to be a beginner tarantula. Get it, raise it. You don't know a lot about tarantulas? Get this species. They're considered very docile. That's what they say. But this guy, ah, he does this. Ugh. I call that a cloud of itchiness. Just watching that is making my hands itch all over again. But just look how beautiful this guy is. He looks fake right there. Uh, I'm gonna do this really quick. I'm just gonna get him in his cup. I've been trying to show him off a little bit, but these hairs are going to drive me crazy. So what I'm gonna do is just keep them in there, use that paintbrush, it's a little soft. I'm gonna grab a piece of cardboard. I'm going to put it over the top of this cup so I can get him into his new home. Here we go. And bam, time travel. Now I'm just gonna add a little bit of this magic soil in here and a little bit more magic soil and bam, I deleted that part of the video. Sorry guys, but I don't know how to get that back. So this round, you don't get to watch me make this tarantula's new home. But as you can see, I gave him a water bowl that I know he's gonna fill up with that soil. I put two entrances to what I hope he makes his burrow but he probably won't because he does whatever he wants. And I gave him plenty and plenty of that magic soil. Now he can live happily ever after. And that's awesome. Speaking of awesome, check out my logo. Awesome, right? Check out at Michael Murdoch Art. He's an amazing artist, an amazing graphic designer. Maybe he could do something for you. If you like what I'm doing, please like, subscribe, leave me a comment. Tell me what you want to see. It's Spider Closet Land.